This is Gio Matteo, the architect. This location is perfect. I'm going to build you a fabulous house. Please stop speaking to my husband as if I weren't here. Anna. <laughs> you may call me Mrs. Gray. I'll pick you up a five. I might not be done by then. We're being followed. been you know great experience and uh you know uh yeah like a sort of fruitful experience and and uh, rewarding experience and um but all good things have to come to an end so you know i'm accepting of that <laughs> dakota's an incredible actress i mean that's that goes without being said she's just a professional you know um as silly as she can be and she can be very silly um, she just has a great way of navigating through every sort of area that, that, that Anna has put through and the humour of it and the heartache of it and the, the, the sort of the um, incredulousness of it and, and just struggled to understand Christian and um, I thought she just played all of those beats with such ease, you know, it just comes easy to her, you know, she's very naturally gifted actor. I know. Anna Steele is the name I use at work. I need to have my own identity here. People already think I got to where I am because of you. But you didn't. You got this through hard work and talent. Why does it matter what you call yourself? Who gives what people think? Well, apparently you do. Would you change your name for me? Yes! <laughs> I don't know, it's really low in the back. It's hot. Yeah, but, oh, Christian's gonna love this dress. Help, my zipper's stuck. Oh, let me see. Ta-da! I think Jamie has um, brought an air of, of uh, sophistication and um, also some comic relief to the role, which I think is important. Um, and, and he's quite tender, and I think this is a character that could be very cold and shut off, and I think that he's brought warmth to it, and that's added a lot to the project. How the hell are you, Anna? Jack, what do you want? <laughs> When Jamie and I actually got the first chance to talk and sit down and go over this character, it, it was uh, it was very clear to me that we we thought about the same things. Uh, you know, somebody who very much presents control and um, and seeks control over those around him and is very manipulative. And when he doesn't get that, he l l lashes out in whether in, in, in violence or. Um, sabotage or whatever it is, like a, like almost like a petulant child, and uh, that was something that we we had, we had talked about very early on, which I think really helped me sort of navigate this. I mean, you know that Fifty Shades of Grey is this worldwide phenomenon; it's huge, but you don't really know until you get into it and and you see the immediate response and you see how much people care, and and then to be on set and join a team that's already made a movie together and be the new guy and then to be so welcomed and, and end up having a tremendous amount of fun. Uh, and, you know, Dakota and Jamie and Erica and, uh, and then, and really all the fans that, you know, show their support, whether it's on Twitter or Instagram, it just, it made me feel uh, very welcome, despite the fact that I'm uh, playing the bad guy.